As you may know, around a year ago, the Blocks Fruits developers hosted a fruit contest on their Discord server, where people could submit their fruit concepts to have a chance of winning prizes and to even have their fruit added to the game. A few months passed, and the winners of the contest had been chosen, which gave us eight fruits that could possibly get added to the game in the future. And in this video, I will be reviewing them. Starting off with the first and most popular of the eight, the Kitsune Fruit. This fruit has been hyped by the community ever since the winners were announced, and ever since the update's roadmap was posted, it is now confirmed that the fruit is coming sometime this month. And we can already get a rough idea on how good this fruit may be based on this attack list. From this alone, this fruit may just be a overpowered version of the Leopard Fruit. And like the Leopard Fruit, the attacks will be different in and out of the transformation. Also, it would be cool if there was a full Kitsune transformation and a hybrid form which looked like Naruto's Baryon mode, but blue. The second fruit on the list is the Human Celestial Fruit, another hyped-up fruit that may come to the game, but this still isn't confirmed. But if it did, this would probably be the most broken fruit ever. From this attack list, every single attack looks broken. There might even be a transformation for the Celestial Fruit, but at this point, that's just overkill. Because of that, I doubt they would add it, but it would still be pretty fun to see how it would play out in PvP. The third fruit on the list is the Snake Quetzalcoatl Fruit. This fruit looks like a better dragon, and by the look of the snake itself, this might be another broken fruit. This concept also has an attack list, but it just shows the attacks from the base form, and even at its base, it still looks good. Imagine how much better the transformed version would be. Overall, I think this is a great fruit, and I hope to see it in the game soon. The fourth fruit on the list is the Acceleration Fruit. At first, I thought this would just make you and your attacks faster, but it's way more complex than that. This fruit allows the user to speed up the natural workings of things. Also, the user cannot create. He can only control what already exists around him, like accelerating a plant's growth, to use it as an attack, or to trap an enemy, or even accelerating the particles in the air to cause a massive thunderstorm. I would really like to see how this fruit plays out in game, and I hope it gets added. The next fruit we have on the list is the Great One. Now this might just be my favorite out of them all, it's a very unique fruit, and it looks very useful for every situation, whether that's in PvP or grinding, and I can see this fruit being used in many combos. But the thing that makes this fruit broken is its transformation. Imagine it being the size of a sea beast, and how the moves would be in its transformation. But due to that, they would probably make it way smaller, and they might have to adjust its moveset. The last fruit on the list is the paint fruit. When I first saw it, I thought this would be the worst of them all since all you could do with it is just change something's color. But the concept artist turned it into a really good fruit. Most of the attacks are decent. It has a really good M1 which allows you to slash ink towards the enemy using a brush, as well as the last move which lets you trap them in paint and slam them into the ground. But the best part about this fruit is the different colors which cause different effects. Green causing poison damage similar to the venom fruit. Red being fire, blue being freeze, and yellow being fast damage. All these fruits listed could get added to the game very soon. We already have one in the game, which is the sound fruit, and the kitsune fruit, which is coming sometime this month. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments which fruit you would like to see in the game. Hope you have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.